Hello everyone, in this video we will see how to add shading to a line art using Photoshop with only a mouse. I previously drew a line art in Illustrator and I pasted it in here. I have two layers, there is background and the line art layer, so I will add a new layer for my shading and will only work on this layer. I will use the magnetic lasso tool to quickly select the areas, but I have to warn you, magnetic lasso is not the best selection tool. But my aim is to show shading here, so if you have problems using the magnetic lasso, you can try to use the pen tool to have better selections. When my selection area is complete, I fill it with a middle grey tone, then I will use the burn tool and the dodge tool. Burn tool helps me add some darker tones and dodge tool adds highlights to grey areas. Again dodge and burn are quick ways to add shades and highlights and they can cause some problems. After I add some shading to the overall image, then I use my magnetic lasso again to select all the individual parts and this time I add more refined shadows and highlights. If you're a beginner, you can end up with muddy looking colors or tones, so it is better to use the brush tool instead of dodge or burn. But when you choose to work with the brush tool, then you have to pick your colors. By pressing down the Alt key when you're in the brush tool, your tool turns into the eyedropper tool, so you can easily change your colors. Using a soft brush with low opacity is also important if you're a beginner.
For the rest of the image, I repeat the same processes and shade every part of the car individually, but it is better to look at, look at a reference picture if you don't know where to add darker or lighter tones. For my image, I used common sense and decided to add lighter tones to the upper side and darker tones where the sunshine could not enter like under the car or behind the wheels. So my basic shading is finished and in my next video I will be showing how to add colors easily if you have a grayscale image like this.